did my first half marathon in Sydney last year. I was really pleased to finish my first half marathon. I didn't quite get my sub two hour goal by a few minutes, but I think my biggest regret was just giving up mentally um, towards the end of the race and not finishing strong. After that, I signed up for Run Melbourne to try my best to hit that sub two hour goal. I was really pleased with the way that my training went leading up to this race. Tim was able to help me set up a training plan um, and he coached me through my workouts and that sort of thing. Um, and yeah, I was able to push myself harder than I've ever done before. Waiting on the starting line, I was feeling pretty nervous, but I was also pretty excited to give it my all. It felt like I'd set myself up really well to run a good race. Um, I was keen to get going. Target um, running around 5:15, to 5:20. That was kind of my bracket, um, and yeah, I Come just on, felt Shelby. really good. The first Woo. 10k's just felt like a breeze. Kept having to kind of tell myself to slow down a little bit, um, yeah, so that I could save save my energy for the rest of the race. Um, but yeah, I feel like I could rerun those 10 kilometers over and over again. They felt really great. Go Shelby, you're smashing it. Feeling good? Awesome. Good job. You're flying. You're smashing it. Just some hills and then downhill to the end. Around the 12k mark we hit the hills and naturally that started to feel a bit harder for me. Um, I still felt like I had quite a long way to go at that point and yeah mentally I felt like I was just um, trying really hard to stay positive and to just set small milestones to kind of keep going. Come on, Jeff! Fast! Just after we passed 17 kilometers, there was this really nice long downhill that just gave me like the boost that I needed. Um, at that point, there was less than four kilometers to go, less than a park run to go. So I just, yeah, there was no excuses. Come on, Shelby, pick it up. Pick it up towards the end. Hey. Go, go, go! Come on, Shelby! Final push, whatever you've got left. Coming around that last bend, there was just a little hill to the finish, and I knew at this point there was only a couple hundred meters to go. Um, and I was on, within Shelby. my time goal, I knew that, but I didn't know exactly what time I was going to run, so I was just giving it my all, um, yeah, sprinting through to the finish line. To be honest, it was pretty hard to keep my emotions at bay as I got my medal and tried to find Tim in the crowd. Um, I was so happy with my time goal, of course, um, but I was most proud of the way that I'd run a mentally strong race and that this time I didn't give up. 